Alrighty guys, welcome back. I don't even know where we left off. It's been months and months and months since I picked up a camera. We've just been thrashing on this thing to get it done because we don't have much time anymore. So, I think last time we were starting to mock up the uh, turbo kit and all that. And we have our final product. We're mere days away from firing this unit up the first time. since you guys seen this so this is what it looks like we're almost done with this thing we're probably about a week or so away from firing it up we're missing a few fittings over there yet but minor details was already shipping on the way um today we're basically just knocking out wiring there ain't much left adam's working on that right now i don't know if he's making a video on that or not we'll see um uh, we got our fuel cell back here fuel pumps one there and one up there fuel cell is in as well um, I built this entire cold side all these welds and stuff they these are my first attempts at welding aluminum and I would think that they went relatively well considering so, yeah everything's buttoned up I'm just cleaning up some rocker arms and push rods for this thing. That's all the engine needs yet is that. And Adam's doing the wiring. I'll show you guys the interior real quick. So this is what the interior is looking like. I did another custom shifter um, made out of sockets again. This one is actually really sweet and it's super tight. The shifter itself does not move at all. Um, the only wiggle room is actually in the tranny itself, and that's just supposed to be there. Uh, we also put in a detachable steering wheel because I have very long legs and it's hard for me to get in and out of this car. So that big boat steering wheel had to go, and we went with something a little bit smaller and just overall nicer. I mean, it was expensive, but it was what money well spent, I think. Because I also wanted to have buttons on the steering wheel. Um, I think I'm going to do a scramble here. Line lock is going to be there. Uh, horn. And I don't know. We'll figure out what's going on with this one. Don't really know yet. And that's pretty much for the it for the interior. We'll see if we put a dash back in it. I'm not really sure what I want to do with that or not. But I think it looks pretty slick. So, super pumped to see this thing fire up. 